Hey, welcome back. Do you remember when I uploaded this earlier in the year? That's Midsummer Chartige by Clara Tesh of the Floating Sofa Quartet. If you're not familiar with that tune, but you really love it and you want to learn it, you can have a look at my YouTube video, which has got the full tune, and you can use the speed function down in this corner to have a slow go. Or if you want to go through it in much greater detail, I've got four one hour long classes that are on demand on my website. They're pre-recorded so you can grab them anytime. That's four hours of tuition plus sheet music and handouts. And you can have a great time online with me learning that tune in great detail. My intermediate level online classes focus on broadening your repertoire, looking at left hand variation and finding that inner groove that's really going to make your music swing. Here's a sneak preview of what we went through in one of the classes. It is a slight syncopation. Okay. Now, the first note here, that's the first note, the first beat lands on the beginning of that note. So this is the the true beginning of the B music is on the, the C natural. It's a dotted crotchet, so it's worth three quavers or three micro beats. And last time we talked about counting those micro beats in our bellows. So if we do that here, we recognise where the syncopation lies in, a, in between the first and the second notes. So you end up with three micro beats on the C, two on the B that goes next. So you've got that extra little shove on the second micro beat of the B. Okay, the B is made up of two micro beats. It's a crotchet on the paper, two quavers, so it's two micro beats. So you've got two little chugs in your bellows, but the second one is where the punch hits. Because that's where the third beat lies, basically. Okay, so just try that out as we go through. If you're ready to explore those micro beats a bit further, try it out now or wait for to come back to it later. Um, I really enjoy online learning. I don't think it is a, a second rate tuition mode. I don't think it is lesser than classroom learning. I, I love learning in bite sized pieces. I find actually whole weekend courses a bit overwhelming. Um, so I like to be able to do a little bit and consolidate and the quality of the, you know, video recordings that you give and all the online uh, access to handouts. I really value it. It's wonderful. I'm going at my own speed. Get over to my website, have a read of what's on offer, what you're going to be learning. I've got in classes for improvers, intermediates and advanced students and I'm really, really excited. I've got such great feedback. You can read about it all online. The link's in the description. I'd love to see you on board.